If my toddler could vlog, this is what I reckon it would be like. Morning, guys. My dad left cereal on the side, so I should probably teach him a lesson. <laughs> they just told me off for pouring the cereal everywhere, but what they don't know is I need the toilet, so I'm going to wait until they take my nappy off. So we just got back from playgroup, and this kid pushed me over. I didn't react, but I'm keeping a tally. Every day is, don't go up the slide, don't go up the slide. I just don't get it. Mommy and Daddy keep saying I can't have breadstick for snack. They want apple, me to have apple or banana. So I'm just going to climb up and get the breadstick myself. <laughs> So we've just sat down for dinner and they've made something new that has all the stuff I like on it, but together I don't actually like it. So I've decided I'm just gonna go to the toilet now. <laughs> so it's time for story time in bed and mummy and daddy asked who would I want to read to me? And I chose daddy because he always takes a lot less time. He just says a few words and then it's time for bed. Wow, that was a long eventful day. I think everyone had fun, including my parents. It's about seven o'clock now and they've put me to bed. I'm gonna wait until about nine to go to sleep so they can miss all the TV that they want to watch. And I reckon I'll, I'll, I'm gonna wake up at five because I'm sure they'll miss me by then. Bye. If my six month old could vlog, this is what I reckon it would be like. Morning everyone. Last night was so much fun. For like 12 hours every hour, I'd wake up mum and dad just to see how they are. I am ready for a nap. I've had morning cuddles and morning milk and pulling dad's chest hair. I'm gonna scream until they put me down for a nap. <laughs> I screamed for so long that they put me in the big bed. Night guys. Woo, that was a good one. I'm refreshed. Where's mum and dad? Hi guys, I couldn't help but just write a song about how I'm feeling today. I just want my big brother to give me attention. Oh my God, guys, I'm so angry. My parents actually just put me down on a mat on my own with toys. Like what? So apparently mummy and daddy can just invite other babies around for play dates. Do you even know they eat some food and then bring them in for a kiss and then spit? Do you even know that game? So mummy and daddy gave me a bit of carrot to chew on and then when I actually bit it off, they got really, really excited and went, no! It was really, really fun. Then they couldn't find it, but I found it, so I'm gonna have a bit more. I think that was the best day of my life so far. It was even better than yesterday when mummy and daddy went red and sweaty and they said I'm worried, which is a new word for I'm really, really excited and having fun at this exact moment. So I'm gonna go to bed now. Night. The tree! The tree! I remember the tree! I remember the tree! Say hi to the crispy tree! Ah. How did I not remember that happened? So for breakfast today I'm having butter and marmite toast, but I'm having it untoasted and with no butter and marmite. And my dad said I'm allowed to have coffee now because I'm two and a half. I have to have it in a plastic cup now. My dad just told me off for trying to get one of the balls. Balls? Why would you even have a tree if I'm not allowed to play with it? I've spotted mum going in the snack cupboard a lot of times today. She says she's just checking to see if everything's okay, but I want in. What do you mean it's not chocolate? It looks just like you had just unwrapped it! I'll have a spicy fruit then! Uh, guys, my parents are just giving me hummus and carrot for lunch. I don't care if it was my favourite yesterday, that was years ago, this is disgusting! It's a dinosaur and a piece of cheese. <laughs> Outfit of the day, so we're off to the shop. So they said I can get dressed on my own, and uh, I've gone for the shorts on shorts, shirts on shirts with a low ponytail. What do we think? Let me know in the comments! I really hope we're going to Lidl, that's my favourite one, because you get to play with everything in the middle, and Dad shouts like, that's too sharp, or you've just stolen that! I really don't want to go to Waitrose though, because it's too cold. Well, I don't want to use the spoon, I want to use a candy cane! Hi guys, welcome to dinner. I've got rice today, well they made me rice, because I through the pasta on the floor. I think that might be my favorite day of all time, especially when I put that bread in the buggy without telling mum and dad, and I made it all the way home. All right, night guys. Morning. I had a dream last night that a man came down our chimney and ate all our food. Nope, I've seen Home Alone enough times. I'm not taking any risks. Oh, we're going out in the car today, so I ate my breakfast really, really fast, and now I feel really sick. I wish someone in my life would have told me this would happen. Yes, I know they make me see clearer, Daddy, and my experience of life more enjoyable, but if you made me wear my glasses one more time. So my daddy said when he was younger, like 48, Two years ago, uh, everyone vlogged from their bed playing a ukulele, so I'm gonna do that now. My dad's so old. Out for the day, guys. My parents let me get dressed on my own because they say it helps with my creativity, but I don't really understand what that means. I'm hot. If you make me put these glasses on one more time, I'm going to number three in your shoes. You don't want to know what number three my is. My mum got really loud in the car earlier. Another person in their car talking about getting fudge off the road. If they want to get fudge off the road, why don't they just eat it? I am putting them on. How can I hear you if I don't have my glasses on? Oh my god, I'm pretty sure that was the best day of all time for me, anyway. Definitely for Daddy and Mummy. So uh, I've actually learned how to put music at the end of my videos. So no night. My heart